Back to Billboard's Hot 100 of September 14, 1968, almost 50 years ago. Another great Lost Motown record I want to share with you. I can't dance to the music you're playing, that you're playing by Martha and the Fandellas. Not as slick. As not as slickly produced as Dancing in the Street and Quicksand, but still a fine, funky number by Martha Reeves and the Fandellas. I can't dance to the music you're playing. Uh, went as high as number 42 on Billboard's Hot 100, and that is it. It's at number 42 that week, September 14, 1968. Martha and the Fandellas on Billboard's Hot 100 for two months. Um, First off, the Andantes, Motown female session singers, they sang on this record back up. Also another, a newcomer to Motown, her name's Sarita Wright. You may remember a song that Sarita Wright did with, I believe it was Billy Preston back in the spring of 1980. It was called With You, I'm Born Again. Sarita Wright going all the way back to the 60s on Motown. She was dating Stevie Wonder. She sang the choruses on the on this record I can't dance to the music you're playing she sang on the chorus of the record instead of Martha Reeves because Martha Reeves and the Fandels they were on tour their touring schedule prevented them from from coming back to the recording studio to re-record their vocals, their choruses on the song because the producers today had changed up the music, thus it was Sarita Wright who sang on the chorus although at the end of the song you probably hear Martha Reeves chipping in uh, her vocals near the end on the chorus of this record. Now here's the thing about this song that I want to tell you about. A guy named Deke Richards co-wrote this record. As a matter of fact, I think he produced it. Let me bring that up for you real quick to double check on that. I got to talk about Deke Richards. He was one of the biggest uh, he was one of the biggest uh, Motown writers. Indeed, he produced this record. I can't dance to the music you're playing. I uh, joined the Motown record label in 1966. And uh, Deke Richards was, well, after Holland Dozier Holland, prime songwriters at Motown, after they left the label in 67, Barry, the, Barry Gordy formed a Motown songwriting collective called The Clan. That included R. Dean Taylor. The Clan and Dick Richards, they wrote I'm Living in Shame, and they wrote Love Child by the Springs. Later on, around 1969, Barry Gordy formed another songwriting collective at Motown. They were known as The Corporation. This included Barry Gordy and a guy named Freddie Perrin. Freddie Perrin, who later produced Boogie Fever by the Silvers, and I Will Survive by Gloria Gaynor. That was later in the 70s, major producer in the 70s. But uh, Dick Richards, also a member of the corporation, the corporation wrote the early hits for the Jackson 5. Well, they, they produced it. They produced The Love You Save, ABC, I Want You Back, Mama's Pearl. They produced all those early records by the D Jackson 5 in 1970 and 71. Dick Richards. Dick Richards co-wrote. He produced this record by Martha and the Fandellas. I Can't Dance to the Music You're Playing. Coming in at number 42 on Billboard's Hot 100, September 14, 1968.